My name is Dr. Mohan Keshav Murthy. I'm Director of Urology, Uro-Oncology, Robotic Surgery and Transplant Surgery at Fortis Hospitals, Bandargata Road, Bangalore. Today we are in the uh, Robotic Surgery Room uh, in the OT Complex on Level 4 of Fortis Bandargata Road. We are working on a Da Vinci XI. My colleague Dr. Basavraj is uh, doing a simple nephrectomy. Now the point uh, of today's uh, discussion is how has robotic surgery changed the perspective of urology and how, how has it benefited an individual patient. Now with increasing diabetes in the Indian community, uh, more patients have less kidney to work with as they age and especially when they are affected by kidney cancer, it is essential that you spare as much of the kidney as possible. To put things in perspective, the liver is a female organ, the male is the kidney is a male organ. What do I mean? If you abuse alcohol and only 10% of the liver is left and you give up alcohol, the liver does grow back to almost near normal over the next 12 months. However, the kidney cannot grow back. Each cell can only work more but can't create a new cell. So if the patient has a kidney cancer, it's essential to remove only the cancer and a millimeter to two millimeter margin of healthy tissue and leave as much of the kidney as possible. One and a half kidneys is better than one kidney. And herein comes the ability of the robot to provide the uh, kidney to, to provide us the ability to leave as much kidney behind for the patient as possible. Combined with 3D uh, lens uh, ability is the precise uh, uh, marking using intraoperative ultrasound. We have a BK ultrasound, the world's best uh, ultrasound, which can be dropped in through a laparoscopic port to precisely mark the, the margin between the healthy tissue and the cancerous tissue. Uh, blood loss is minimal and cosmetic effect is wonderful. So we can return the patient to life within a few days after such a difficult surgery. In the prostate, especially the android pelvis of the male, which is a V, and unlike a U in the female, there is very little space for cancer prostate surgery. The robot which is, which is with its arms allows you to manipulate the prostate in a narrow confined area to provide not only a cancer uh, a cure benefit uh, but also a continence benefit which is the single biggest problem for men who undergo cancer, pro cancer prostate surgery. In other areas such as in incontinence surgery, uh, sacral colpopexy for the woman using the robot is a major benefit. Uh, radical hysterectomies in those patients who have cancer of the cervix or the uterus is again a daycare procedure using the robot virtually bloodless in those patients who have a PUJ congenital obstruction the robot has converted what was a very difficult laparoscopic or open surgery into a precise and simple surgery with a hospital stay less than a day overall whether it be a, a cancerous pathology or a congenital problem or a incontinence a reconstructive incontinence problem the robot has brought solutions to both men and women in the indian context which was hitherto unavailable combined with with reasonable costing ability at fortis hospitals banergata road the robot does indeed seem to be a, a, a revolutionary a weapon in our fight against disease in, in the indian context